Ramsay Snow is on his way to Ironrath. It's got the red force. This is simply not how things are done, Mira. Not in King's Landing. Okay. I'm sorry, my lady. <sighs> Soon I will be queen. And maybe then I'll be in a better position to help you. But for now, now, we must both be cautious. I must send a raven. I have to warn my family. If you'll excuse me, my lady. First. Well, that's some fucking shit right there. I don't know why I expected better. Now. Marjorie Darrell, you're just a... M'lady. Yes. Begging your pardon, m'lady. I hope I didn't frighten you. How long have you been waiting there? Not long. I was just passing by when I saw you emerge from Lady Marjorie's room. Right. I hope you saw. I was right before. About Lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. I just want you to know, I... I can help you if you'd like. And your family, if you're willing to How? trust me. I hear How? all sorts of things. Things that could be useful for you. How can you help me? My problems can't be solved by what you might overhear. Which is why you must trust me, m'lady. You need allies. Yes, Hopefully I'll prove I can be useful to you. Seeing that... I'm sorry. I... I really must go. Please don't despair. I know people who... Alright then. People who'd be willing to help you. Like who? Like that guy, what's his face? Uh, Littlefinger? Yeah, no thanks. Fucking rapist. Cut of how more like it? Either way. What are you looking at, prick? Tin cat motherfucker? It looks like his cloak is made out of fucking uh, metal. Whoa. Was it supposed to do that? Nope. Oh. Where the bloody hell is Duncan? He bailed on us. What do you think? Angry. I'm without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us, but I'm confident we've enough strength of our own. Your men are ready to act if needed. Yeah, our plan is a good bit. one. It will work so long as everyone does their part. Bolton Confidence. Men approaching, my lord. The fucking fat lord. Something what wrong with your gate. What do you think? Where's our men? We said we'll greet. What? Where are our well, men? Aren't you, the little lord. No wonder you can't open the gate. Shall we help you? Shall you fuck off? Now let me in. <laughs> this is a lovely pile of timber, isn't it? Why the <laughs> hurry? Are you cold? <laughs> You know, I am a bit. Oh, Fortunately, there's no shortage of wood to burn around here. Oh, okay. Okay, good one. Thank no. you, my lord. We all know who raised the gate. That fucking prick Duncan. Motherfuck. A token for the new... Warden of the North. Let me guess. Forrester Iron. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Ironwood. Doesn't look like much. Don't know what's so special about it. No one can match our skill. Is that so? Indeed. <gasps> look at how good it is. Not bad. Lord Whitehill. Can your lot do this? 
Given enough time, we could learn. Given enough time, you could do a great many things. But not this, apparently. That's pretty good fucking chill right there. Why is he walking like this? Can somebody <laughs> tell him no? Quite the army you have, Lord Forrester. Very impressive. Hmm. Yes. Can somebody backstab this motherfucker? Oh, this is interesting. This is very interesting. Quite interesting. Goddamn loading goddamn goddamn screens. Goddamn. Goddamn, I froze like shit. Shouldn't have happened. Damn, that picture is so goddamn. Is that okay? Stop saying goddamn. Seriously. Look at that. More foresters. Lord Ramsay? Come out where I can see you. Force him to focus on the business at hand. What is it you want, Lord Ramsay? What do I want? Everything. Nothing. We'll see. First. Let's see you bend the knee to my father. Lord Bolton. Warden of the North. Words yeah, that's not going to happen. Anyone no. can say they're loyal. I only kneel to the king. Is not the warden also deserving of your respect? But then, oh, he... I am not my father. Perhaps that is what you meant to say. You see? He's a fucking traitor, just like his father and brother. Here's no. the thing. I don't care about your loyalty. Then you should the crown, however, her. wants what you've got. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries. Ships, shields... Chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. Sure. My father has promised as much to the king. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. You needn't worry. Your father will have what he needs. That's a good little lord. You can't trust a forester. They murdered our men. It was so, a forest squire who did it. One Whitehill soldier dead. One Bolton. Yet uh, your man lived. He was within his right. They killed his family. His right? He killed a loyal soldier in my father's army. What? You had me stand <laughs> out in the wind and muck so you could show off your pathetic little army. That sort of we can wipe you out right now, right here. Loyal. Bannermen will not do. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. The White Hills will be taking control of your Ironwood from this day forward. What? What? The no. Ironwood? But... The White Doesn't Hills are nothing more than up-jump thieves! You can't do that! <laughs> Why not? You know something the White Hills don't? Uh, we are do we? talking about trees. You grow them, you cut them down. It can't be that difficult. We have loyal craftsmen it is that the finest difficult. weapons. The White Tellers have no such craftsmen. Do you want Ironwood for the next five years or the next fifty generations? That's that good little right Lord there. does have a point. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half of your Ironwood, and we'll see who fares better. But my lord half of something is better. Than the nothing you had before. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men within your walls. At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ethan! They'll help maintain the King's peace and make sure there's no more trouble. Ugh. Ah, I couldn't click. Ah! What? 
Don't send in that motherfucker that I hate. The goddamn cap mother. You have a man you trust? My son. Griff. Griff. We'll lead the garrison. Who's Griff? The seven hells he will. Lads. Do make this visit worthwhile. Please, Sir Roiland. Don't. Look at this little forester. You're not frightened, are you? Lord Ramsay, please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? I'm his twin, my lord. Oh, twins. Well, like the Queen and her brother. Well, <laughs> hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. Ha! Ha 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 ha! I never had a sister. Always wanted one. Enough, Lord Snow. I have an idea. You'll come with me. You can be my oh, but no. lord. Lord Ramsay, that's enough. Where are men? Do you like hunting? Let her Do you go. like fucking off? She's quite pretty. Your sister. We'd get along well. I suppose you can stay. No. Aren't you? You can see me right now, choke middle finger. What have you done? But I don't want a bowl, Lord. Far too much trouble. You fuck. My Lord! I knew you'd bend the knee eventually. I think we've come to an understanding. Ethan! I certainly feel better about all this. Ethan. Oh, come on. However, uh. the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Uh. Stop! Brian! Take the boy as your ward. Oh, no! Kill him if they give you any trouble. Brian. Lovely meeting, all of you. We'll have to do it again sometime. Somebody help him! Fetch the mace so quickly! You brought this on yourself. Mama! Please, stop! Don't let him take go. me! You will not take him! Help! Ryan, please! No! Ryan! Do something! Ethan? Oh, my son. Fucking hell. Game of Thrones, ladies and gentlemen! Game of fucking thrones right there. Wow, I I literally got goosebumps when it happened. I did not see that coming. I didn't. <laughs> oh my god. Are you fucking serious? Holy fuck. Ethan sacrificed himself for us all. He saved Talia's life. He'll be remembered as Ethan the Brave. Oh my god, I called him that! Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. I called my him Ethan the Brave before I even named him. Holy fuck. And you I guessed it. Without flinching. We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forrester above all other loyalties. Jon Snow! Woo! Not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again, our house will not oh, fall. Shit. We will be ready. <laughs> Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Fucking hey, that Are really you got me. For what might happen. All right, all right, all right. Episode one, Iron for Mice. You had a forty-seven percent state with Bowen, which is. Do I get... Oh. oh, that's my friend. Okay. You and 73% sword loyalty to the king. You and 90% took Eric's swingers. Obvious. Oh, why, really? Okay, well. You and 39% pick Royland, Roy, Royland as Sentinel. Well, it doesn't really matter because I'm dead. You and 36% met Ramsey at the gate. Again. Doesn't fucking matter. I died. <laughs> That's great. That's... Woo! That's really great. 
That's really fantastic. I can't. Oh, uh, this was very good. This was very good. Like, holy shit. Wow. I was really feeling a bit slow on the progression and everything, and it was like, ah, are they gonna go faster later on or not? But the progression was pretty good. Like, you know, they really did boost it up in the end, making quite a few changes. I really didn't expect that to happen at all. Like, I didn't. I guess I'm not used to it from Telltale games, right? You usually don't get drastic changes like that. Ugh. When was the last time that that happened? When Carly got killed. When Carly got killed, that was the only, like, what the fuck moment, right? This was pretty much the same thing. <sighs> fuck. This was really intense. This is really fucking intense. Can we skip it, please? I really don't feel like... Okay, there you go. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Wow. <sighs> Whew. All right. So I have one question, though. Did fucking that other guy, what's his face, betray us, or something? Because he wasn't there. He wasn't there. He probably fucked us. Hopefully, next episode we get to play as him, right? I Asher. I've been interesting. He looks pretty cool. Whew, my goodness. What an intense fucking thing. If I didn't have a lot of commentary, there was a reason for that. It means because I was engaged in the story. That's good. Anyways, this is it for the episode one of Telltale's Game of Thrones. And I'll see you next time.